Coming up, Amy Winehouse, someone from the new Twilight movie gets their top off. I know. And... Find out what that's all about in the Showbiz Top 5. At five, hands up who'd love a bit of airbrushing on their holiday snaps. But Kelly Clarkson fans may have a different opinion. They're annoyed about a shot of the star on the cover of Self magazine, which was retouched to make her look slimmer. The mag's editor says they were just helping her look her personal best. Ironically, the article inside is all about how the singer is happy with her weight. Some readers say the pic is so altered they changed her whole body shape. In at four, now take a look at this. An inventive new way to make music or a cheap ploy to get a bunch of girls in their undies. I'll just ask the man behind the human synth, Mr. Kelvin Harris. We've got this conductive paint on our hands which is non-metallic, it's perfectly safe. Each pad is a section of a song and in certain configurations when you touch each other by the hands um, you make a noise. Yeah, but how come he got to keep his clothes on? Anyway, in a few years time we could all have one. Uh, we're going to try and sell some, you know, complete with humans um, for many, many millions of pounds. Next up at three, here's a party I'd love to have been a fly on the wall at. I tried to make her go to rehab, she said no, 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 but Amy Winehouse said yes, yes, yes to a British barbecue. She held one at her home in Barnet over the weekend. The Beehive One apparently plans to stay in London for a bit after several months sunning it up in St Lucia, proving not so much back to black as back to her best. In at two, look in the dictionary for the words in demand, and there really should be a picture of this lady next to it. The phone hasn't stopped ringing for Paula Abdul since she decided to leave American Idol, and after offers of work from rival show Dancing with the Stars, it's reported she's now in talks to appear on Ugly Betty. Go Paula! Maybe she could be Wilhelmina's new arch rival or teach the gang some new moves. And my top story at one. Want to see a Twilight star without his shirt on? Silly question, really. Well, now's your chance. Taylor Lautner flexes his pecs as Jacob in the sequel to the vampire movie, New Moon. Bella, I won't ever hurt you. I promise. You're sort of beautiful. The trailer's out. Only problem is, movie bosses are only giving us 14 seconds of it. I know, how evil is that? The full version's being shown in cinemas in the US ahead of teen movie Fan Slam. That's your lot more Hot 5 action a bit later. Uh.